we now learn how to find the least common multiple of two whole numbers. And we will do so looking at two examples. The first example will be to find the least common multiple of 3 and 4. We do this in two steps. The first step, I'll just write 1 here, is to list the multiples of both of the numbers. So in this case, the numbers are 3 and 4. So I'll just write multiples of 3 and 4. Well, the multiples of 3 are 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, and so on. On the other hand, the multiples of 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, and so on. And that's our first step done. The second step, I'll just write 2, the second step is to find the least common multiple. And we often refer to the least common multiple as LCM. So I'll just write find LCM. Now, to do this, all we need to do is look back at the lists that we made in step one. Those are these two lists here. And we look for the smallest number that both lists have in common. Well, looking at these two lists, it doesn't take us too long to see that they both have the number 12 in common, and 12 is the smallest number that they have in common. The least common multiple of 3 and 4 is therefore 12. And we write this as follows. LCM, and then in parentheses, 3, 4 equals to 12. This means that the least common multiple of 3 and 4 is equal to 12. And we're done. Now the good news is this method works for finding the least common multiple of any two whole numbers. Let's look at another example to see that. Let's say we need to find the least common multiple of 8 and 6. Well, once more, we follow our two steps. The first step will be to list the multiples of 8 and 6. So I'll just write multiples of 8 and 6. Well, the multiples of 8 are 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, and so on. The multiples of 6 are 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, and so on. That's our first step done. The second step, just as before, will be to find the LCM. And looking at these two lists, we're now looking for the smallest number that these two lists have in common. And it doesn't take us too long to see that the smallest number that they both have in common is 24. And that's the LCM, or least common multiple, of 8 and 6. Finally, we can write LCM of 8 and 6 is equal to 24. And we're done. That's how we find the least common multiple of two whole numbers. I hope that helps.